That starts a dim report. We're taking to New Hampshire where Kevin Butler was uh, doing some cleaning in his kitchen. I think his wife was too. Some women do this with their jewelry, some don't. But his wife, Mrs. Butler, I don't know her name, she had taken off her wedding rings. Mm -hmm. She had a couple of rings on her ring finger. And sometimes people do, uh, women do that to keep them safe. Sometimes women do that to, to clean the rings. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Either case, I don't know what happened. But she had her, nap her rings wrapped up in a napkin. Well, as I said, Kevin was cleaning the kitchen. And he saw this wrapped up napkin. And you know what's going to happen. Yep, it goes he right in the trash. He grabbed up the napkin right in the trash. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Oh, no. Now, where they live uh, in New Hampshire, he took the trash to what they call a transfer station. Mm -hmm. I would have... It Is that like, what you do there? It sounds like he doesn't have trash cans. They may not have trash pickup mm -hmm. where he lives. Right. So he went. He took the trash directly to the transfer station. Now, what, of course, he did not know was that the rings were inside the trash bag. Mm -hmm. So uh, no one knows exactly what happened when he got home, but I'm sure it was ugly. Well, not pretty. Yeah, he's the one at fault here. Is he? Is he? Well, I don't think so. She she should never have balled it up in a paper in a napkin, towel. In a napkin. To dry. No, yeah. I don't think so. Well, a few, anyway. A few hours passed. Mm -hmm. Kevin said, they've got to be at the dump. So he goes back at the trash transfer station, told the supervisor named Dennis Sendabaldi, I think I threw out my wife's wedding rings. To his credit, the supervisor, Dennis, got right to work. Mm -hmm. They started looking at surveillance tapes. Mm -hmm. They determined when Kevin showed up and where he tossed his trash. So they knew what part of the dump to go to. That's smart. It really is. Very, very smart. Then they got the excavator out and start, mm -hmm. you know, wow. scooping up giant piles of refuse. Mm -hmm. After six scoops, Kevin said, that's my bag. He saw it. He, he knew it. He recognized his white bag. What? Inside, a celery stalk. Uh, Dead giveaway, he said. There was a celery stalk in my bag. Well, he knew then. <laughs> This guy's Columbo. <laughs> One more thing, Tom. They got it. it. They got it. Okay, so... Uh, so they start digging and digging and digging through. They open up the bag, mm -hmm. and there it was. Right at the bottom, the rings wrapped up in the napkin at the very bottom of the bag. Wow. Wow. That's pretty good. It that, that, kind of is. That they went through it and got it. Now, we have the husband and the guy who Dennis. worked at the dump talking. She looked around for the for her rings. I said, I got a good feeling they may be in the trash that I just took to the transfer station. And it was the very last napkin in there that I opened up, and there were the two diamond rings. He jumped up, gave me a big hug. He took a couple pictures with us. Um, he even came in the, the following Saturday, bought the guy's pizzas and stuff. That's pretty cool. Oh, way to uh, go, Did you like Kevin. that? Yeah, that's solid. That. Now, here's the question, of course. If I accidentally <laughs> threw my wife's diamond away, Oof. would I crawl through 20 yards, 20, 20 pounds, pounds of garbage? Of garbage <laughs> yes. Going you wouldn't want to, but yes, you would. That I would if I had thrown it away. Now, it's insured, mm -hmm. but if I threw it away, you better believe I would mm. do that. Insurance would never, in your wife's heart, it wouldn't uh, cover nothing. No, no. In fact, you'd never be made whole. Mm-mm. -mm. You know, my wife, it's that ring or no ring, really. Mm -hmm. uh, that's, yeah. that's the way she... Well, like, I've had friends who have lost their wedding rings. Sure, I know a couple of them. Numerous times. Yeah, well, <laughs> yeah. And they just get a new wedding ring, put it on. Now they get one of those, like, rubber ones. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they're selling those, like, on ESPN now. Yeah. The, those durable bands. And my wife said, don't you dare. It's not the same thing. It's not about a piece of jewelry. <laughs> Some vulcanized rubber on that's your right. finger. <laughs> <laughs> it, like it, a, it, like a C ring. That's right. It, <laughs> That's right. That's exactly what it is. <laughs> that's what my that's what my ding dong ring is made of. Brings back old times. That it? vulcanized rubber. Now I've lost that. It, it doubles in the bedroom. You know, okay. <laughs> Hard part stretching it. Okay. <laughs> Look, I've lost. As you know, I can't find my ding dong ring. Yeah. This ring never leaves this finger. Yeah. And the reason is she, she told nailed me, it in. Didn't she catch you once on camera playing with she it? She did. Yeah. Yeah. I, I mess with did. it sometimes. You'd spin it like a coin. I used to. <laughs> like a child. True. She told me it's not about this ring. It's about the fact that she shoved it onto this finger mm -hmm. 20 some odd years ago. Should have never come off. That's right. So she's talking about it's not about a new piece of jewelry. It's about this. It's our union. It's yeah. means something. That's, that's, that was there that day. That's right. Ah, squawk, squawk, squawk. Is your uh, ring engraved? It is on the inside. What if you? What if this guy lost it and he goes back and finds it, but it's a different inscription? <laughs> <laughs> over hill, Too over dale. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. ever, ever fail. fail? Yeah. <laughs> Where's the end? I need to get this polished. I've just noticed it's all scratched up. But to me, that's you know means you've been through the wars. You know. <laughs> you like, I mean, yeah. love. Yeah. <laughs> and marriage. You know what I'm talking about? You've been through Do it. Do you take it off to pickle? 
No, I leave it on all the time. Leave it on the gym, leave it on the pickle, all of it. But Stick with that answer. <laughs> <laughs> you never know when she's smart. Like, she tunes smart. in and tunes out. Because I used to take it off before I retired from basketball. I took my ring You off. took it off. Yeah. I heard of one guy one time, we probably heard this story at the same time, but well, he dunked the basketball. Oh. And it got caught <gasps> and ripped his. Well, I knew a copy it, did that. It was his classroom. It de. It de. It, it uh, stripped his. It took finger. half his finger off. It degloved him. Yeah. Ugh. It's horrible. Brian, mm. you're talking about lost rings. This guy went through untellable pounds of garbage for it. Go ahead. Yeah, my may, story may not be as extravagant as the last guy's, but I just got married. Um, my mother wanted me to put some straw or hay up underneath her deck behind her house. Mm hmm. So I did so, and sure enough, my ring was gone afterwards. Yeah. So I'm like, wow. So I go get a metal detector, mm -hmm. get up underneath, try to find it, cannot find it. Mm -hmm. I took the metal detector back and went back and and just you know went to trace my steps back to it and found it immediately. Wow. So okay. It was a, it, not as crazy and wild of a story, but yeah, no. I was so glad to find it. My wife was too. I'm telling and you, and all what. that hay—that's amazing. That—that that really is. That's pretty good. Metal detector comes in handy there. That's That'll work on a ring. Yeah, yeah. Do, it did yeah. work. It worked. It whether it was platinum, I don't know the reason why, but it, yeah, it did mm -hmm. not work. Yeah, the metal detector did not did work, not work. Said. That's right. He just retraced his steps. The metal detector did not work. Yeah, that's right. About that. Interesting. Thank you, Brian. I don't think I'm, would a metal detector pick up gold. Mine's gold. How much is gold? Well, I you how many, know how many, how many K's yeah, how many in that percentage? How many carrots? I, I, I think, think the fewer the K's, the uh, the better chance it's going to show. Most up on a men's metal wedding bands are kind of low in gold, right? 10, 14? I think it's a fourteen. I think it's fourteen karat gold. Yeah. Is my guess. And I was surprised that it wasn't. I thought it'd be really, really expensive. At the time, it was not. Yeah, yeah. men's bands are a lot cheaper. Yeah, it wasn't horrible. Is your well, bands themselves are? Um, does your wife take her rings off to do? Mm -mm. Housework. She never takes them off. She never does housework. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> See, so it's win, it's win, win. Did I say that? <laughs> Honey, done any housework? I'm not taking these rings off. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Did I say that out loud? She's like a good that? woman. Gracious, a lot. She's a good woman to have. <laughs> Are you kidding me? She does not. She does not take the ring off. No. <laughs> Brit, <laughs> what in life would let her? What, what would force Leader. her to take it off? I can't imagine Prison? anything. <laughs> Death. <laughs> Even then, she's going no, with her. She's going it? with her. That's no, going with her. I mean, they say you can't take it with you. She yeah, will. No, she will. Brett, you're talking about losing a ring. Go ahead. Yeah, yeah. Uh, my wife was riding in a horse show, mm -hmm. and uh, the, the diamond fell out of the ring itself. Ooh, ooh. And, uh, you know, we, yeah, yeah, we couldn't find it. We, we, we made the trip over there about five times. You know, to try to try to get that thing, and we couldn't find it, and uh, it was frustrating. Oh, did you never find I can't it? Imagine. Never found it. Never did. Never oh, did. Man, that yeah, is. Terrible. I mean, is it e either it's dirt or grass? You're yep, never going to yep, find that's it. That's right. God, it's just Lee, a, most Lee. happens. And, every and day. that would never. Yeah. You know, a metal detector would never find the diamond. No. 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 Oh, that's awful. That is mm -hmm. so terrible. Uh, when my wife lost an earring once in a field. A field. A, yeah, she was walking across a field. It was a Thanksgiving thing they used to do at the school where she teaches. And every year we'd go back, and she'd make me and our children get down on all fours and look. <laughs> as long as we're here. In the area, because she had to walk across a big field, and that's when she – one of her favorite pairs of earrings, she lost mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. And so we would get down every year for about five years straight, and finally she gave up on it. And, you know, they no longer have the, the Did you ever pageant. Did you place the earrings as like a gift? That's a great idea. For Maybe Christmas? This year. No. Let's go to break. No. <laughs> What a wonderful gift no, idea. I did this not. is self incrimination. <laughs> <laughs> did not. I have not. Well, don't you think it would be a wonderful gesture? That would be a great gesture. Did she buy those earrings or did you point. buy them for uh, her? I don't even know. Do you, you think he bought earrings? I, I don't think I did. I don't know. Brindle's is closed. I don't think I. Service merchandise is not open I don't anymore. I don't think I did. You're right. I, that's exactly what I should have done. That's true. Great idea. Yeah. One of these days, yeah, maybe. One of these days. One of these days.